the minister is a liar. He's the one who has been caught lying about his military record, and he's lying again. The, the nickname was actually created by Sikhs who were criticizing Jagmeet Singh, and Jagmeet Singh has sold out Canadians. He said he would be a voice for workers, and then he signed on to keep Justin Trudeau in power in order to get his $2.2 million pension. So here we are, we have to wait for an election until next year because that's when Jagmeet Singh gets his $2.2 million pension so that he can buy his fancy watches, cars, and Versace bag. That does make him a sellout. And uh, my, I'm a strong supporter of the Sikh community. My deputy leader is a Sikh. My finance critic is a Sikh. Those are the two most senior positions in the entire conservative shadow cabinet uh, are Sikhs and they have Singh in their names. And uh, I love the Sikh community and uh, I'm going to keep uh, reaching out and uh, across the country. I'm the only one championing the Sikh values of faith, family and freedom. And uh, you know, under, under Trudeau and Singh, the Sikh community is not safe. They're being targeted. There's been assassinations, extortions, uh, car thefts. They, they have, their children can't afford homes. I'm the only one fighting back. I'm the only one fighting for a direct flight. To Maybe the minister should actually focus on fighting for Sikhs rather than fighting uh, and making fate false allegations. Why didn't he get a direct flight? To he signed to the Trudeau signed on to an open skies agreement with, with no direct flight to Amritsar. Singapore, Malaysia, UK, UAE, Italy, Uzbekistan all have direct flights to Amritsar. And yet our Punjabi population, which is the biggest in the world outside of India, does not have a direct flight. Why is it that this, uh, I think the Liberals and the NDP, they really cared about Sikhs. They would actually focus on that rather than on protecting Jagmeet Singh from, from legitimate criticism for his appalling betrayal of Canadians that he was supposed to represent.